You know what I will tell you is um, unfortunate. I want to speak about um, racism. Now, I wanted to come into this location, this store, right? I wanted to come into here and I wanted to, because I'm in awe with the cats. I'm in awe with the cats and I, I love kittens. And I wanted to, when I saw this, I want to do whatever it takes. I want to volunteer all of my time, if I can, to supporting whoever is in here working, right? I go to the door and I got greeted with a kind of like a what the fuck are you doing here so the lady was on the phone and she gave me the what the fuck are you doing here look and then she says we're we're closed mouthed it to me and then she turned away now if I was someone who had just opened up a business if I was someone who had just opened up a business there's no fucking way I would do that right there's no way you know what I would do I would kindly open up the door and I would just say maybe this could be a customer that takes away one of these beautiful cats to adopt right because this black woman has been at this window for over 20 minutes staring at these damn cats. And we have so many of them. Wonder if she would be a good potential customer. You, racism, because I'm, I'm so, you know, it's a jokeable laughing matter when you're a galactic being, it's fucking hilarious. But when you want service, you your mindset goes back to the three-dimensional world where racism is real and racism exists and you just be wanting to slap a bitch that's what you that's what you want to do you want to slap a bitch because in the meantime you are in a dimension where racism still exists but these beings out here don't understand spirituality they don't understand that racism is truly a joke on all of us and that it only exists and taken seriously in the lower dimensions but because you have to interact with beings that are in fucking lower dimensions and that believe that dark skin is shit, you have to deal with ignorance. And I'm, I, you know, sometimes I go in my lower self and I, I be wanting to tell these people off but because I know the game it's not worth my energy it's not worth my energy I was going to you know just ask her a few questions had she opened the door and I was wanted an interview but because she gave me that what the fuck are you doing here and brushed me off I, I got second thoughts even though I'm in love with these cats but racism is is so real it's real in these dimensions and when you get into new earth racism doesn't exist and for those racist ass bastards just know that they will not make it into uh the higher dimensions but i just wanted to tell you guys this be mindful as to the game that is being played out here and it just brought me you know what i'm saying it brought me into my feelings because my heart goes out to these these cats and you know i'm willing to do whatever it takes for me to get in here and assist these beings with these cats like i'll come here every day i'll start promoting for them you know what i'm saying i will do whatever it takes for these cats but because she has a shitty and a fucked up attitude the way she approached me because of my skin complexion because of my my turban i do know that if i was pale skin it would be different and i'm not here to you know what i'm saying racism exists and when you're in these lower dimensions, there is nothing you can do about it but to raise your vibration and raise your frequency to get to another dimension.
That's what you have to do. It's a must. So eventually you won't have to deal with this bullshit and these individuals that won't change their perception or won't get deeply involved into spirituality will be fucked over. And I, yes, I'm in my feelings. I've taken myself to this lower place because my heart is with these cats. But it's not with the being that um, gave me the <laughs> fucked up attitude. But I digress. You guys, racism doesn't exist. Don't play into it. Don't fall into your lower self and give these entities your energy. Step away and don't play. I love you guys.